Welcome back. This video is about 6 ways to add phosphorus to the soil, and some commonly asked question and answers about use of phosphorus fertilizers. Phosphorus is essential for plant growth as it aids in root development, energy transfer, and overall plant metabolism. Here are 6 ways to add phosphorus to the soil. Number 1. Phosphorus-rich plants. Grow plants that accumulate phosphorus, such as legumes, and then incorporate their biomass into the soil. Number 2. Mycorrhizal fungi. These beneficial fungi can enhance phosphorus uptake by plants from the soil. It would be highly motivating for me to share more much valuable information, if you could just hit the subscribe button. Number 3. Rock phosphate. Ground rock phosphate is a natural source of phosphorus that releases gradually as it breaks down. Number 4. pH adjustment. Maintain optimal soil pH, slightly acidic to neutral, to improve phosphorus availability to plants. Number 5. Compost and manure. Organic matter like compost and manure can provide a slow release of phosphorus over time. Number 6. Phosphorus fertilizers. Use commercial fertilizers with higher phosphorus content, like superphosphate or bone meal. Moving on to commonly asked questions. Number 1. Why is phosphorus important for plants? Phosphorus is vital for root development, energy transfer, DNA synthesis, and overall growth. Number 2. How do I know if my soil lacks phosphorus? Look for stunted growth, purplish leaves, and delayed flowering, all signs of phosphorus deficiency. Number 3. Can I overapply phosphorus? No, excessive phosphorus can lead to environmental pollution and nutrient imbalances. Follow recommended application rates. Number 4. How often should I apply phosphorus fertilizers? Apply based on soil test recommendations, typically before planting or during active growth phases. Number 5. Can plants absorb phosphorus without mycorrhizal fungi? While possible, mycorrhizal fungi greatly enhance phosphorus absorption, especially in nutrient-poor soils.